I have been awake since 2.30 in the morning editing the vlog that will be going up today. So I'm a bit drowsy and now actually I'm the late one because I was supposed to be at the warehouse for 11 and it's 11.07. But they can fuck off because I was tired. Matt is bringing his dart there. He has uh, coilovers and a lip kit that he's gonna put on. So I might help him with that. As for the Del Sol, I think we still have to get the fuse box harness out. After that, we can start wire tucking everything. But yeah, I'm heading to the warehouse now. Just gonna grab uh, the good old blueberry caramel swirl, and then I'll be there. I could be nice and get Matt a coffee. Hi, can I get two large iced caramel swirls, both extra extra with a shot of blueberry? Uh, no, that'll be it. Thank you. Thank you. They're starting to recognize me. She said two today? Yeah. Now off to the warehouse. Again. I'll park here. We're here. Why do you guys always attack my car whenever? <laughs> no, John. Can we fuck it? No. <laughs> all right, they're gonna go explore a little bit. I'm gonna get all my shit in the in the warehouse. So there used to be a white Audi <clears throat> or a silver Audi right here, and they finally got that out. They pushed it out. The owner hasn't picked it up yet, and we we did everything we could to it, and. We told him to pick it up and he hasn't picked it up, so they pushed it out. So now we got extra room. So I'm just gonna sweep all this shit up that's been under it for the past month, because it's been here for a month. And then we can uh, finally have some clean space, at least. Is loose. It's We're gonna do the front coils first, and we also just got that out so that we can replace one of his O2 sensors eventually. You still need the extension, right? Yeah. <laughs> Steven's here. I hear a pop. <laughs> you know what that is? Yeah. Yep. The coils that like Where do you guys put the Audi? Uh, GSX. Oh, we oh, okay. scrapped it. We brought over Webster Metal. Yeah, we just. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it looks so much better. Having it here. Dude, you should have saw it before I put mine in here. It was so open. And I sweeped hard. everything yeah. too. So yeah, it's getting, like it actually looks. Ready? Oh. <laughs> yes. So, this is a blow by STI lip, actually. And with the vents, I, it doesn't, it's not a perfect fit, but I feel like it could work. And um, what I have to do now is tap the rest of it in. And then over here on the sides, it's about an inch of a gap that I just have to cut off and make it flush with the bottom.
this all disconnected, but we have to break apart a few things inside the dashboard and uh, go from there to actually get the harness out of the firewall. Finished the lip on the dart. We're taking the coils out now. It's at stock height. So, passenger side coils are in. My dick is stuck between my legs. Oh my god. Mm. Okay. Oh my. Oh god. We are. Uh, we're almost on the ground. Oh my god. What? Is that oh man, look at all that wheel gap. <laughs> Weak. <laughs> we just finished getting the driver's side coils in. Well, that driver's side coil just came out, but we're putting this one in, and then we have to put the coil over in that one, and then we'll be done for. Oh my god, another video. Wow. Okay. Whatever, another video from Ruin Del Sol, ruined his one owner, all metal, fresh, beautiful Del Sol to put teeth on it like a big shot. Okay, another video. <laughs> and then this boy is almost done installing his watt box. I am done. You are done. I oh, that's done. nice. Maybe it'll shoot fire. It should, there's no cat. This is such a big difference. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Go look at the other side. Because now it's all the way down. I can know that it looks like it uh, kind of evened out. So. Yeah, because when you brought the weight down on this, this side. side. This side still looks a little bit taller. How much? You want it a quarter inch. Not much. So we got the coils in all four sides of Matt's car. Trying to wire up the uh, math sensor. We're going to be doing a little bit to this, but first we're just going to chill out and eat some pizza and watch fucking Napoleon Dynamite! And pizza? And pizza! We out here. Working on getting the uh, fuse box harness out now. You have to disconnect the ECU and... But Matt stole my 10. Yeah. Matt being a twat. Stole his 10 mil. I'm still zoomed in, aren't I? Fuck. We have to get the headlight harness out. The ECU. The, uh, fucking... So we can get the fuse box harness out. And then after that, uh, take out some emissions stuff. And then, hopefully I can start sanding the, uh, bay and getting it ready for paint. But that'll probably be next weekend. Not much Del Sol stuff going on this weekend. Let's focus more on this faggot's car. So we got a lot of the main like heat stuff out of that side. We were able to get that portion of the harness over there disconnected. But that portion of the harness runs all the way behind the dash to this portion of the harness. And then comes out the top. There and is what this is. So this runs from here all the way through, through the dash, comes out over from the fuse box. And we can't get that out at the moment. You're a taxi. I am not a taxi. Give me that. Give me that. Steven. Yay! Is that gonna be your... Yeah. So there's really not much that we can do at this point. We have to get those harnesses out so that we can get to the rest of the engine bay. And then um, we can start hopefully painting and sanding the bay because I have to do that. And then while I'm doing that, 
he can work on his own car, which is the black SRT4, which has been sitting there for weeks because he's been so occupied working on customer cars and everything. So he can work on that while I work on this. What are you doing? Hi, Dad. I'm taking off the manifold, Dad. Good son. You're making me proud for once. I hate you. <laughs> So I guess I could say yesterday was kind of the main video, rusting Clint's truck for the week. I focused a lot on that. We had the whole day to do, you know, that job. Today was get the coilovers in Matt's car, do the math sensor on that. He had to take the watt box out of one of our friend Joey's SRT4s, and then he put that into this SRT4. And then we got Matt's car out of here. We had to get all that stuff in his car uh, wired up properly. Now we're taking the manifold off of his SRT so that he can get that motor out so he can put this built bottom end in. So like I said, we have to wait on a couple tools that we need to properly get the rest of the inside of the dash out so we can get to the rest of the harness so we can get that all disconnected, get that out, and then we can start uh, tucking it and I can also start uh, sanding and painting the Engine bay. I think that that's about it for tonight for the Del Sol. We're gonna just finish taking this out and then probably call it a night. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video even though it really didn't have that much of an objective. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you liked it and we will see you next weekend. Peace out.